Students are returning for the fall semester and classes will be beginning shortly. But how much does a college education cost for a local student? Valley News Team's Katie Opperly breaks down the numbers and tells us how you can keep from breaking the bank. We look at what the cost for tuition and fees, room and board, books, and your miscellaneous expenses like your toiletries and, and, and that type of thing. So all that adds up. A lot goes into college. At North Dakota State University here in Fargo, a student living on campus pays over $8,000 for one semester. And this doesn't include various other charges like parking or books. The average cost for books for a student is about $800. But Jeff Jacobs says living off campus might not offer much relief. By the time they pay for their cable TV and all the other utilities, it's pretty, pretty close as far as what they're paying out of pocket between living off campus and, and living on campus. So the cost will add up no matter where you spend your college years. But he does say studies show students perform better academically when they live on campus. And this could lead to scholarships. Most of our scholarships are academic based. Most scholarships require a 3.5 grade point average and they can be used to help pay for any college related expense. Jacobs says scholarships can really make a difference when it comes to saving the bank account. You know, it could be $500 to, to 5000 So he says preparation is key, and the earlier students and their families start saving and applying for scholarships, the better off they will be. Those who are just walking in and they, they, haven't, they don't have any savings and, and um, you know, the, there isn't a lot of programs uh, available if they're, they haven't applied for scholarships, haven't applied for grants. He also says the Bank of North Dakota offers programs to help make college more affordable. So don't wait and start looking into options now. In Fargo, Katie Opperly, Valley News Live. Jacob says students should speak with financial services at their school to learn about their options when it comes to the cost of college.